In this video, we're going to find out how infamous hackers are taking over Minecraft servers and could this be the end of Hypixel? In the last week, there has been a huge security breach affecting companies from Amazon to some of the most popular Minecraft servers like Hypixel. What would happen if the largest Minecraft server was taken over and hacked? What would happen to the Minecraft community? Stop. If you play free Minecraft, don't worry. I'm hosting a new account giveaway, so like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also, by hitting that little subscribe button at the bottom with the bell, you will never miss another video or giveaway. Join my Discord server right now if you want to be the first to download my brand new texture pack, and let's get into it. What would happen if the largest Minecraft server, Hypixel, was hacked and forced to shut down tomorrow? Over the last week, there has been a serious attack against every single Minecraft server. And not only that, companies like Apple, Steam, Amazon, tons of services have been affected. So what's going to happen to Hypixel and some of the largest Minecraft servers? I'm not a developer, so I'm going to explain this to all of you in simple terms, as I know many of you probably aren't developers and wouldn't understand. But before we get into it, make sure to enter into my giveaway if you haven't. Like this video and uh, let's find out if Hypixel is getting hacked tomorrow. Can you imagine if some Somehow you wake up tomorrow and Hypixel is shut down. I am seriously scared. So how did I find out about the hacking of every single Minecraft server? Well, it all started last weekend. I was visiting my friend who happens to be a cybersecurity engineer. And one evening he turns to me, he goes, are you protected? Have you, have you got yourself securely protected against hacks? You know what's happening right now? I have no idea. Personally, I'm not a developer. I'm not very good at coding whatsoever. I wasn't aware of this situation. Situation. Now, if you're living under a rock just like me and you don't watch the news just like me, this may be your first time hearing about this. Essentially, around a week ago, there was a serious security breach in one of the most important pieces of software running on Java. Now, if you don't know what runs off of Java, well, every single Minecraft server, in fact, Minecraft itself. And it doesn't just stop there. We're talking about Minecraft, yes, but this affects Steam, this affects Apple, Amazon. This is a huge hack for a part. A now you're gonna hear the word Apache a lot in this video because this is the software affected right now And like I said, I'm gonna explain this in the most simple terms possible But essentially hackers in China of, of course of course China have somehow have made contact with Apache Telling them there is an exploit within the software that allows pretty much anyone to run a piece of command a certain code And they can get access to a lot of information now. Why does this involve Minecraft? Well for Minecraft Mojang has updated every single version of of their game recently. Now, before I go any further, I'm also going to leave a very good Hypixel forum post down below, but you can get a bit more of a detailed answer to what's actually going on and affecting Minecraft servers as well as players themselves. This doesn't just affect servers, it affects you and your data. This isn't a video to scare you or anything, but if you want to find out a little bit more about what is going on, I would highly recommend checking the forum post below. I'm going to leave some other information down below you can check out as well regarding the hack. As I was saying, this affects players and pretty much any Anyone who can be vulnerable to this line of code running on this certain version of a part Apache and if this line of code is run on your game or even if you see it in game you are vulnerable to a potential hack it's kind of scary and you know the scariest part about this hack currently as I'm recording this there isn't an official fix there's just ways to slow down this process by updating and that's what I want to get onto but vanilla players out there playing Minecraft Mojang have already updated every version of their game except alpha, beta, combat change screenshots and snapshots. If you have any instances of games open, close them right now and restart your launcher just in case you haven't already updated and make sure you're playing in online mode. Now, what if you don't play through Minecraft's launcher? What if you use Luna, Badline or Forge? Well, for Luna client, LabyMod and Badline client players, all the clients have currently patched it. And you may have seen something about this already posted on Luna. They were actually one of the first to alert pretty much the whole community that there was, this was going on. So high chances that you've already been updated and this shouldn't affect you anymore. But like I said, make sure you've checked you have updated just in case you haven't. I think most of these clients auto update now, which is great. Now I know what you're thinking, Tom, I don't use any client. I don't use Minecraft. I use Forge. Now for 
Forge 1.12.2 users, Forge have patched for this version and beyond. So please reinstall Forge from their website and then you can just play it and it won't affect you. For 1.7 to 1.11 users, Forge said they won't patch it and it's time to update. So that pretty much means if you are playing on Forge from 1.7 to 1.11, I would just recommend uh, using a client or updating past this version. Don't be stubborn because you will leave yourself vulnerable. But you can also use MultiMC or use the thing Creeper hosting made and there's a link to that in the forum post. Now the vulnerability from this hack mainly affects servers as it allows a player to send this payload on their end and gain massive opportunities to access restricted areas not meant for players. What I'm very happy to announce is that Hypixel have already taken action against this hack and have slowed this process down to make Hypixel pretty much safe. Someone can't grant themselves access and just exploit the whole server which is great and I think it's one of the large reasons why they've disabled the chat on Hypixel like you can't type anything on Hypixel. I don't know if you've noticed at the moment but yeah you can't type which is great because one of the ways you can get hacked is through chat messages and client logs that would also be at risk. However right now you have to be very careful because you could be joining other servers that haven't set up this system at all and this opens you up to potential hacks and danger. It's very concerning as the exploit has been made public there's a ton of tools around exploiting this though and while the Minecraft community may seem kind of wholesome it can be ruthless and a lot of players might be unaware of this risk and think they're fine until they just get hacked. I just think it's crazy how it's affecting so many different services. Like we're not just talking about Minecraft servers, we're talking about a whole range of media services, Steam, Spotify even, Apple, iCloud, Amazon. It's crazy the spectrum of this hack and the scale of it. I personally don't watch the news at all. I don't like the news. I never really have. But this is currently plastered all over the American and European news. It's kind of scary. Now, personally, my whole job consists of being on the internet. So I like to take my security very seriously. This video wasn't intended to scare you by any means. It's mainly just to let you know what's going on right now. If you don't already watch the news or read anything online, it's, it's a pretty scary thing that's actually occurring. And I find it crazy how all of these different companies are kind of com connected through this huge hack. You know, you would never have pictured Hypixel within the same ballpark as Steam or Apple, you know, all being affected together. It, it's definitely very scary. It's probably a lot of work for anyone working on cybersecurity or anything like that right now. But I just want to make sure you guys are staying safe. And if you don't want to do anything about it, just check check your passwords. You know, just make sure nothing has been changed. Make sure you're staying protected as best you can. As I mentioned, this video wasn't intended to scare any of you. I really hope Hypixel stays strong because at this point, it's the last beacon for Minecraft. It's the last hope for multiplayer Minecraft servers. And I do believe some servers will be heavily affected by what is about to take place. I mean, it's already been taking place. A good thing that most of these Minecraft clients like Luna, Bad Lion, Baby Mod have already taken action as well as Hypixel. I don't usually make videos talking about this kind of thing. This is huge. This is affecting so many different areas of business, of the internet. It's just, there is so much going on right now. And for the most part, you should be safe. However, I don't want any of you guys getting hacked or falling for any kind of anything happening on the internet right now. So I wanted to make this video just to raise your awareness to this and I really hope you enjoyed it. I'm not really some type of news channel so this isn't something I would typically cover. I do have a very big interest in what's actually happening. You know it is very scary considering there's no fix for this. It, it can happen to anyone and the actual hack itself is called Log4J. If anyone was wondering for whatever reason that's like what it's referred to as and it's on the Apache software which is connected to Java and pretty much every Every single Java server or network is run off of Apache. So it's kind of scary. I don't really know what to think about it right now. I have no idea what's going to happen either. But what I do know is that I actually enjoyed making today's video. This is something very serious that I feel like needs to be brought to everyone's attention. And it's already a very big global phenomenon. But I hope you all enjoy it. If you guys did, please be sure to leave a like. I have many giveaways coming this Christmas and we're only just getting started. Christmas is uh, eight days away as I'm recording this. So I hope you all enjoyed and and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.